look good. A little rough around the edges, but good. It's Monday, April 9th, and here's your IMD Brief. I got a really good feeling about this. And so do we, Han. On Sunday night, what may be the final trailer for Solo A Star Wars Story dropped, and oh my porg, was Chewbacca hugging another Wookiee? Clearly we have a lot to unpack here, so... I wanna buckle up, baby. The movie is filled with tips of the cowboy hat to old film genres like the western. The backroom space poker game, the shootout on a train, and Alden Ehrenreich's performance that's a mix of Clint Eastwood, Lee Marvin, and of course Harrison Ford. I waited a long time for a shot like this. We can see films noir, like Double Indemnity or Out of the Past, casting their shadows over the style and tone, especially in Amelia Clark's femme fatale character, Kira, as well as in the twisty double-cross plot. I assume everyone will betray you. Never be disappointed. More film noir is buried in Solo's DNA as father-son writing team Lawrence and John Kasdan cite The Big Lebowski as a major influence on the script. Since the Coen brothers designed Lebowski as somewhat of a stoner comedy response to the 1946 noir classic The Big Sleep, both films could be at play in Solo. Hello. Hello. We also got our first looks at a couple of new characters, like this helmeted foe, who we know, thanks to Denny's trading card series, is Infis Nest, a dangerous marauder who leads the pirate gang, the Cloud Riders. And here's Paul Bettany as Dryden Voss, the gangster who put our team of heroes together. Michael Kenneth Williams was originally cast in the role, but scheduling conflicts caused him to drop out during director Ron Howard's reshoots. Everything you've heard about me is true. The trailer spotlights Donald Glover as Lando Calrissian, who appears to already have that reputation that Han himself would one day appropriate. Yeah, I know a guy. He's the best smuggler around. Since we know Han got his Millennium Falcon from Lando, perhaps this begins their war of stealing from each other that ends with Lando swiping Han's clothes at the end of Empire Strikes Back. Seriously, what was up with that? A couple more bombshells from Solo. First off, what was Han having a really good feeling about? Could it possibly be his infamous Kessel Run, the hyperspace smuggling route? This is a ship that made the Kessel Run in 14 parsecs. 12! And we finally learned Chewbacca's true age. 190 years old? <laughs> you look great! That means we haven't scratched the surface on two centuries of our favorite Wookiee's life. Maybe it's time for us to lobby for a Chewie origin story movie. <laughs> To catch the latest on Solo, you can download the IMDb app and add it to your watch list. We'll have Lucy Hale from Truth or Dare on the IMDb show on Thursday, April 12th, plus so much more on this summer's biggest movies. Go to imdb.com show to stay tuned and tune in.